And here in Accra, President Akufuado used the occasion to project his government as a defender of free speech. He says, this is evident in how Ghanaians are able to express their opinions publicly without any governmental suppression. Let me state that I am a firm supporter of free speech. The government I lead is also a firm supporter of free speech, amply evidenced by the atmosphere of free speech prevailing in the country. However, we must all bear in mind that words can be as incendiary as guns. The Bible tells us that death and life are in the power of the tongue. All it took was the muttering of words by some irresponsible journalists and amplified by the power of radio to ignite the tragic genocide in Rwanda. It is important for all of us to recognize that there's only one country we call home, and that is Ghana. We must protect our way of life with, in the words of the National Pledge, with all our strength and with all our hearts. We should not allow the actions and utterances of a few misguided persons to jeopardize and destroy the united Ghana we currently possess, which is the envy of many in the continent and in the world. 